Vocational School of Chemical Analyst. Our today's topic is the difference between organic and inorganic compounds. 1. Organic compounds are compounds which basically have carbon atoms as the main element in their structure, along with other atoms such as hydrogen, oxygen, and nitrogen. While inorganic compounds basically do not have carbon atoms in their structure, generally, they are oxidizers, strong acids like hydrogen chloride, strong bases like sodium hydroxide, and salts like natrium fluoride. 2. Organic compounds are the result of the activity of living things. But over the times, organic compounds can be synthesized in laboratory, for example, protein, fat, benzene. Inorganic compounds do not come from living things, but rather from mineral and natural resources, for example, oxygen and carbon dioxide, which can be obtained from the nature. 3. Organic compounds have covalent bond because they are composed on non-metal atoms. But most inorganic compounds have an ionic bond, which is a bond between metal and non-metal atoms. Only a few of them have covalent bond. 4. Because the bond is stable, Organic compounds are difficult to react. Thus, the chemical reaction rate will be slow. To make it faster, we need a catalyst. Inorganic compounds will experience rapid chemical reaction because the bond among the atoms are not as stable as organic compounds. 5. The interaction among organic compounds is low and not strong, so that it is easy to break. As a result, the boiling and melting point of organic compounds is low. The interaction among inorganic compounds is strong, so it is not easy to break. Thus, it requires a high boiling and melting point. 6. Organic compounds do not dissolve easily in water because they have different nature. Most organic compounds are nonpolar while water is polar. This is not in line with like dissolve like principle. To dissolve organic compounds, organic solvents, which are also nonpolar, are needed. While the nature of inorganic compounds is the opposite, which is generally soluble in water because it has ionic bonds. 7. Organic compounds have properties that tend to be flammable because their elements are mostly carbon. While inorganic compounds are relatively non flammable, because not all of them come from carbon. 8. Organic compounds are generally non-electrolyte, meaning that they cannot conduct electricity because they have no ions. However, inorganic compounds are generally electrolyte. It can conduct electricity because they have ions. 9. Most organic compounds are colorless, while most inorganic compounds are colorful because they are in group B on periodic table, and their natural properties are indeed colorful.